Saints Chrysanthus and Daria, third century c. 283, are saints of the early Christian period. Their names appear in the Martyrologium Hieronymianum, an early martyrs list, and a church was built in their honor over their reputed burial place in Rome. Topic <inaudible> Legend. Topic. <inaudible> Acts of the martyrs relating the legend of Chrysanthus and Daria exist in a Greek and in Latin versions, dating from the 5th century and all, without historical value. According to the Catholic Encyclopedia, according to legend, Chrysanthus was the only son of an Egyptian patrician, named Polemus or Polion, who lived during the reign of Numerian. His father moved from Alexandria to Rome. Chrysanthus was educated in the finest manner of the era. Disenchanted with the excess in the Roman world, he began reading the Acts of the Apostles. He was then baptized and educated in Christian thinking by a priest named Kerpiphorus. His father was unhappy with Chrysanthus's conversion and attempted to inculcate secular ways into his son by tempting him with prostitutes, but Chrysanthus retained his virginity. He objected when his father arranged a marriage to Daria, a Roman Vestal virgin. Chrysanthus converted his new bride and convinced her to live with him in a chaste state. Vestal virgins took a vow of chastity during their 30-year term of service. They went on to convert a number of Romans. When this illegal act was made known to Claudius, the tribune, Chrysanthus was arrested and tortured. Chrysanthus's faith and fortitude under torture were so impressive to Claudius that he and his wife, Hilaria, two sons named Morris and Jason, and seventy of his soldiers became Christians. For this betrayal, the emperor had Claudius drowned, his sons beheaded and his wife went to the gallows. The legend states that Daria was sent to live as a prostitute, but her chastity was defended by a lioness. She was brought before Numerian and ordered to be executed. There are many variations to this legend. Some claim that she was subjected to execution by stoning, others say she was beheaded and yet others claim she was buried alive in a deep pit beside her husband. They were entombed in a sand pit near the Via Salaria Nova, the catacombs in Rome. The surviving acts of Chrysanthus and Daria state that on the anniversary of their deaths, a large number of Christians had gathered at their underground crypt to pay their respects when Roman persecutors surprised them, filled the crypt with stones, and buried them all alive, including Diodorus, a priest, and Marianus, a deacon. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Historical notes. Topic. Numerian was not in Rome at the time of the martyrdom of Chrysanthus and Daria. The Romans would not have sent a Vestal virgin, who was supposed to be the keeper of Rome's fortunes and for whom it was imperative to remain a virgin, into a whorehouse. Scholar of early Christianity Candida Moss states, This simply could not have happened. Whoever composed this story lived during a period when people no longer understood how important Vestals were. Topic. Relics Topic. At least three places claim to possess the remains of Chrysanthus and Daria. In the 9th century, their reputed remains were brought to Prum in modern-day Rhineland Palatinate, and these relics are presently in the Church of Chrysanthus and Daria, Bad Münsterreifel, Germany. In 1011, Pope Sergius IV gave Fulk III, Count of Anjou, the reputed bodies of Chrysanthus and Daria upon his return from a pilgrimage to Jerusalem. Fulk gave them to the monastery of Belli Locus, now Bolules Loches, which he had recently established. The Cathedral of Reggio Emilia in northern Italy also contains relics reputed to be those of Daria and Chrysanthus. A scientific study of some of the bones there confirmed that they were those of a young man and a young woman in their late teens, with a radiocarbon date between 80 and 340. References External links Catholic Encyclopedia, Sts. Chrysanthus and Daria Patron Saints Index, Sts. Chrysanthus and Daria Holy Protection Russian Orthodox Church Holy Martyrs Chrysanthus and Daria in Orthodoxy Selected Lives of Saints The Two Lovers of Heaven, Chrysanthus and Daria at Project Gutenberg. A Drama of Early Christian Rome by Pedro Calderón de la Barca, translated by Denis Florence McCarthy.